Hi, good evening to the ladies, to the gentlemen, to the boys, to you girls. This is your host, this is your guy himself, DLG Repping. Yeah, I'm back again. Good evening. Or is it good morning to you? Or is it good afternoon to you, wherever you are watching around the world? So, um, I've got um, a couple of football contexts again. One of whom that involves Chelsea. Because they're closing in on um, Thiago Silva, who is going to sign for one year. And um, Everton, because it's been reported that um, Everton are closing in in an audacious bid for James Rodriguez. (laughs) Right, so um, allow me to start off with Chelsea and Thiago Silva will sign for one year. This is a guy who's um, vastly experienced, played in World Cups for Brazil, um, spent a number of years with Paris Saint-Germain winning them the league untitled um, f- for a minimum of four years in a row. And for me... He's um a figure, a big figurehead in the dressing room for me, not just at um, Paris Saint Germain, at AC Milan, and then for the Brazil national team. For me, it, uh, I think Chelsea have got themselves a good defend, a very good defender, world class. He'll be the best centre half at the club by a country mile. I mean, Chelsea fans, um, are you uh, excited about the um, Thiago Silva joining you for one more season? If you've got any um, thoughts, any um, opinions, then leave it in my comment section below. I think he's um, there just to add um, his experience and his um, wealth of um, talent for the, the whole se- for the whole of next season. I don't think he's going to be there for the short term. I, but again, we shall see. <clears throat> you know, Chelsea are looking strong there. You know. Kai Havertz could be on his way, should be on his way soon. And I will expect um, another signing to be imminent as well. So, you know. Uh, moving on from Chelsea, um, it's Everton. And um, they've come close to, um, they're coming close with an audacious um, bid to sign James Rodriguez on a three year deal. I mean, Ancelotti speaks highly of him. He says he likes him, and he said he likes him a lot. However, he says he's a Real Madrid player, and he said that he's going to be a. He said that he thinks he's going to be a Real Madrid player. I mean, that's Ancelotti all over for you. Very um, realistic and completely honest in his interviews. But for me, it will be. A, I think it will be a signing that excites Everton fans, you know, and for the club, it shows um, ambition. I mean, Everton does it show ambition and? Another question for you guys. Would you be excited to see James Rodriguez in a number 10 position um, for your team week in, week out? Everton fans, get back on me, get back to me and um, let me hear your thoughts and your opinions. Just leave it all in the comment section below. I think it will be a good sign and a good coup for you guys. I mean, you'll be pushing to go for the top six with players like him, but I think you'll need a little bit more. Am I right in saying that? Um, again, leave it in the comment section below. So, um, it's um, another day. Um, this Saturday, it is Arsenal versus um, Liverpool in the Community Shield. And um, it's a game that I look forward to. However, there's been injury news on um there's a bit of injury to Van Dyke and he's a slight doubt for the game, but I believe he'll start. And um, I'd like to talk about the Arsenal game behind closed doors with Milton Keynes. I mean, it came out the blue, but I saw the game and I, well, I saw the highlights and I saw the goals. And um, yeah, nice finish by El Nini. Rob Holding with a nice finish, but at the wrong end of the... <laughs> goal <laughs> and otherwise um, it was a good um, workout good little um, session and I expect um, 
some of the players to start against Liverpool on Saturday. It's like the players like Aubameyang, possibly Leno, possibly Salaba. I would like to see Salaba make his debut. Um, Gabriel Magalhães, will he sign in time? Will he sign on time for the um, game? It's a big, big question. I mean, what do you think, Arsenal fans? Do you see Gabriel Magalhães um, signing on time for the uh, um, Arsenal Liverpool game? It's a big, big question. If you've got um, any answers, any thoughts, then leave it in my comment section below. So allow me to um, wrap this up and say ladies to the gentlemen, to the boys, to the girls, thank you for listening, thank you for watching me and always thank you for tuning in. I'll be back um, tomorrow afternoon and I doubt if I do the morning. I want to be back in the morning, but I'll, I'll wait till I come back from work and then start again um, all over, start all over again in the afternoon. And um, I'll be back in the evening as well. Once again, um, I thank you all and um, peace again, love again and bless again. Have a good evening and make sure you rest well. Um, bon voyage.